Hello everybody, how's it going? This is Nemina, welcome back to part 28 of my Let's Play of Radiant Historia. As we left off, we got out of the sewers. Finally. It was, it was atrocious down there. It was, it was a mess. A complete mess, and that's an understatement considering the sewers. You know, it's dirty, full of things you, you don't want to deal with. Including monsters and things that were falling from the sky that were pink, disgusting, and... Let's just not talk about them any further. We're done. We're done. We're cutting out that part from our lives. And we're continuing on. We made it into the palace. And we're going. I also like to point out I have 12,000 gold. It's pretty nice. I'm going to be able to buy some pretty sweet stuff. But let's begin. Let's begin. Also, the audio is probably a little different. Because I'm messing around with new settings. Because I feel like I'm always too quiet. And no matter how much I edit my voice. It just seems to be not be enough. So, hopefully, this is good. Alright, anyways, let us go. Ooh, a cutscene arena. How's it going, friends? Oh, it's them. Damn you, got your grubby hands off of me. Shut up. How did you get in here, anyway? I'm gonna try to do some more voices. I know I have stopped doing them. Oh, they got caught. They just had to get in our way, didn't they? Now the soldiers will be on high alert. You're right. It looks nearly impossible to get through undetected. Forcing our way through isn't exactly an option. Hold on, this is- my mics bother me. It's too close to my face. There we go. Forcing our way in, that's never a good way to go. Even if the assassination succeeded, we'd never make it out alive. But can we really avoid casualties given our situation? I have to think about this one. Alright, so if I'll be a decoy, we will die. If we go in stealthily, it'll work. Because that's how this game works. It's 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 gotta work. Let's go. Come up with a way to reach the princess undetected. Is that the best course of action? Uh yeah. Let's go. My hair is in my face. It wouldn't be wise to stir up any trouble at this point. Let's pull back. We need to reassess our situation. Get them upstairs. Cross-reference them with that tip off we got. Yes, sir. What should we do, Stock? That passage is crawling with guards. We'll never get through unnoticed. Ooh, I chose the right one. I am... Oh, my God. I called it. It's faint, and I can sense the granicles your energy here as well. And taking those guards won't solve anything. Indeed. But it will be difficult to pass without them being without them without being discovered. Can you learn to talk, Nemanon? Please, come on, you're making me look bad. Do you have any idea what will you will comp oh my <laughs> one day. I do. Heise is the key. He single handedly created Spessin. His espionage skills are unparalleled. He taught me the basics after I transferred from the army. But just the basics. He may know a skill that would be useful at a time like this. And again, I doubt he'd just up and teach it to me. Is it normal for an employer to give their subordinates the skills they need to succeed? He's anything but a normal employer. The more you struggle, the more he wants to test you with their own limits. That's the highs I know. I see that he might teach you if you are not his sub that he might teach you if you are not his subordinate. The other timeline. You're right, I left highs in that history. If you cannot extract something from him due to your current relationship, alter the relationship and perhaps you will save a chance. True enough, I'll give it a try. If there's an opportunity to run the highs in that timeline, that would be my chance. Now that's the spirit. You're growing quite accustomed to tra traversing history. Keep it up, stock. Alright, I got this. Until we meet again. Alright, so this is our point where we're gonna do that. Okay, uh, that's cool. Now we go back. First things first, I want to save. I'm just curious what my time is. What do we got? 10 hours? That's not too bad. Uh, uh, okay, so now we go back to the other timeline. Finally. Because we learned the skill to um, see invisible things from Ot. So, that's going to be great. Yeah, and I did it. But what's this one, I wonder? Oh, that's probably, um, the little girl. Okay. God, that was a long story. Now, where am I going? Uh, I think it's over here. The Valkyrie stock is leaving. Uh, 
It's this one, right? Yeah, I, why can't I teleport there? Alright, I guess we have to go to this one then. It's unfortunate, but, you know. Whatever. It's not a problem. I am gonna skip ahead until the next part. You know, so you don't have to see that. See you guys then. Alright, we're back. And I am literally the dumbest person, because as I was going through that, I was just thinking, wait a second, didn't I have to do something before that? And yes, I have to check for the bombs. That is exactly what I have to do. I don't know exactly where they are planted. Was that a bomb? No, that was a dude's face. I don't remember if it said anything like location of the bombs. All I know is we have to look for them. There we go. Oh, emerald. Well, that sounds expensive, and I look forward to selling that. Mm-hmm. I kind of want to go outside, actually, and see if there's any interesting items. Because I have so much gold, I could buy a lot of neat stuff. Like, um... Ugh, I think I mostly need items to heal up. You disarm the bomb. There are four more bombs left to disarm. See, I'm so smart. So smart. You know, good job, Dylan. You are so good at this game. <laughs> I'm so... I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm guessing there's no more on this floor, but it never hurts to check. But I have a feeling. Something... Yes, I knew it. Oh my goodness. Okay. So those things. That's gonna be neat. So I think um, there's one more of those upstairs, I believe. You know, we can get some nice stuff there. That's great. Hey guys, how's it going? Having fun talking? Yeah. Alright. Now, let's go upstairs. Uh, at least let's try to go upstairs. Uh, I'm, although, there are only three floors, so I'm guessing there's more than one per floor. So we are going to have to make a nice, clean sweep. So let's go to the next stage. Stage. You know, with the amount of money I'm getting, I could start using my mana crystals. Though I haven't really encountered a situation where I'd actually need to. So it's all good, you know? We're gonna go to the third floor very shortly after we find the bomb here. I have a feeling that with this new ability... Nice. Three more. Uh, I can find a lot of cool items going around, so... I am gonna be a lot more observant when traveling around, you know? See if I can pick anything up, you know, that the good stuff. Now, this is unfortunate that to make a nice Ooh, there is another one right here. Sweet. Oh oh, oh my god. Did I seriously pick up two mana crystals? Alright, that's pretty nice. Um alright, I didn't I didn't know you could actually find them. That is neat. I know we have encountered a lot of uh, things like that. Where they were just crates just randomly blocking off areas and you don't quite know why. Super confusing for me. And then I found out. Two more. So they're probably on the final level, so let's go do that. Yeah, that's really quite awesome that I found those two. I can uh, start using them if I want. No, no problem. No problem. Easy money. But, uh, of course. So I'm the bum. There's one left. It's probably on the finals level, too. But let's just, uh, or is this the final level? This is the final. Because, you know, I'm so smart. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. And here is that spot I want to check out. It's probably where the final bomb is. Leaf ring. Oh my goodness. That sounds kind of underwhelming. Items. Oh my goodness. Alright. Wait, this is a, a poison resistance. So, HP 20 and mana 20. Well, I mean... Well, I mean, that could be good for... Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna get a Terranium. Yeah, that's a great idea. Good job, I'm glad I thought of it. So, magic defense... Let's give it to her. That is an amazing item for her. Uh, you know, the HP isn't... You know, I don't care about that at all. But the mana, oh my gosh. It's beautiful. God, that was a great item. I'm really glad I found that one. And the final bomb should be in here. If my calculations are correct. Alright, gotta check out what that is, too. Scroll, huh? What is this, though? A th HP regen. Oh, special. Alright, white page. 
Inscribe the secret spear technique of magic defense. I'm guessing that's something I learned in the radiant or in the in the story. Inscribe a secret spear technique for magic defense, so I'm guessing that's something for rainy then. That's pretty cool. I like that. It's not a bad piece. Although magic defense currently is pretty useless. Isn't there Is I wrong? Was it not in this one? I guess not. I guess we'll just keep looking downstairs. I guess I gloss over it. I swear, if I have to skim through every little bit of this place to find the last one, I am gonna flip a table here. But luckily, it's not that good, yeah. So it's cool that we can find some really nice and powerful items, you know? I think I already uh, checked out this little spot here. Nothing there. I don't know if I went left down here, though. So let's go check that out. Yeah, I don't think I went to that room. So we'll give that one a good looky look. Just a uno momento. Yeah, I think we already looked in that little area. But this this room seems uh, suspicious. Like a, like a great place to plant a bomb. I want to know is how... Oh, there it is! Nut! Oh my gosh, game, please stop teasing me. What is this? I don't even know what I picked up. Was it this? I think it was it. No. It was probably that. Yeah. So, what are these Panakia things? Here's all elements. Here's all elements, all and. Ooh. So, if I get like mass poisoned, that is the item to look for. Oh. Stay. What's this? No way. Is this gonna do what I. Oh my gosh, it healed me to full. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I like that. I didn't necessarily need it, but. It regenerated my mana, so I mean, can't really argue with that. It's good to know that I don't have to go all the way to Alistair for that sort of thing. I am very happy about that one. I don't, I don't know where I missed out. Like, where's the final bomb, bro? You know, I'm not, I, I can't see through walls. I have to actually run at it. You know, like a, like a madman. Alright, so that was that one. So I guess, go up here. This is gonna be cool. And then we have to go back and, you know, learn something. Which is great. I think I already looked in this room too. Never hurts to try again though, I suppose. It seems like it would be a good spot to throw a bomb since there's, you know, fire. You know, you know, you know look at the fire here from the furnace. You know, you explode that and boom! There it is. Disarm the bomb. I think that's all the bombs in the fort I've disarmed. Hopefully that'll cause some positive changes. Oh, yes. Yes, it did. But, but, that is it for this episode, guys. I know, extremely eventful, huh? But in the next part, we are going to begin. Because I have a feeling there's a lot of cool stuff that's going to happen in the next part. And we are going to continue off, and we are going to foil... Uh, not Grado... Ganorg? Granorg. Oh, oh my goodness. Man, thought I was doing my Fire Emblem Let's Play here. But no. But anyways, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all for watching. Stay tuned for the next part. See you later.